Hey guys, welcome to our new YouTube channel Biology Tech. In our previous videos, we have learned more about uh, photosynthesis. Uh, today, uh, basically, today I am going to tell you about photosynthesis. What is photosynthesis, and the effect of photosynthesis, and the raw materials which are uh, excluded from uh, photosynthesis, and the materials which are used in photosynthesis are carbon dioxide. So guys, basically, in our previous videos, we have learned more about osmoregulation, type of, of osmoregulation, osmoregulation in plants. Then we see excretion, excretion in plants, uh, excretion in animals, excretion in bacteria, and also excretion in humans. In this video, we are going to tell you about photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is basically a process which is done in the presence of sunlight. If sunlight is not present, then photosynthesis process will be uh, gone thrown and in the e in the evening the photosynthesis process become um, uh, not work as well as it work in the afternoon so basically there are many uh, processes involved in photosynthesis we have to discuss all these processes in this video so if you are new on this channel then please like and subscribe our channel biology tech and also press the bell icon so you can get all these type of videos on time so let's start our video so guys there you can see that i have already searched there a photosynthesis uh, a website what is basic formula of photosynthesis the process of photosynthesis commonly written as there you can see that six carbon dioxide molecules is taken then and six water molecules is taken and glucose is also taken from this and in the uh, reaction when reaction is taken place then glucose and six oxygen uh, molecules uh, 12 oxygen i think is read uh, as a byproduct release uh, in the photosynthesis this means that the reaction six carbon dioxide molecules and six water molecules are converted by six energy captured by chlorophyll implied by the arrow in a sugar molecule uh, there you can see that and six oxygen molecules the products the sugar is used by organisms and the oxygen is released as a byproduct there you can read more about this photosynthesis photosynthesis is a process by which green plants and certain other organisms transform light energy into chemical energy during photosynthesis in green plants light energy is captured and used to convert water carbon dioxide and minerals into oxygen and energy rich organic compounds uh, it would be impossible the importance of photosynthesis in maintenance of life on earth if photosynthesis ceased, these would soon be little food or other organic matter on earth most organisms would disappear uh, and in the times earth's atmosphere would become nearly devoid of gaseous oxygen the only organism able to exist under such conditions would be the the chemosynthetic bacteria which can utilize the chemical energy of certain inorganic compounds and thus are not dependent on the conversion of light energy there you can see that everything which make oxygen is dependent on light but by some bacteria is not dependent on light they can make oxygen and carbon dioxide in the presence of light or in the absence of light also energy produced by photosynthesis carried out by plants millions of years ago is responsible for the fossil fuel coal oil and gas the power industry social society in past ages green plants and small organisms that fed on plants increased faster than they were consumed and their remains were deposited in earth's crust by sedimentation and other geological processes they protected from oxidation these organic uh, remains were slowly converted to fossil fuels these fuels not only provide much of the energy used in factories homes and transportation but also savor as raw materials for plastics and other synthetic products uh, unfortunately modern civilization is using up in a few centuries the excess of photosynthetic production accumulated over millions of years consequently the carbon dioxide that has been removed from the air to make carbohydrates in photosynthesis over millions of air is being returned at an incredibly rapid rate the carbon dioxide concentration in earth's atmosphere is rising the fastest it's ever 
has in Earth's history, and this phenomenon is ex expected to have major implications on Earth's climate. There you can see that they are want to tell that in previous century there are more uh, number of Earths and there is more type of photosynthesis, but in today there is no more uh, uh, trees. So there is no photosynthesis process and carbon dioxide is increasing day by day. So if you want more this type of video then please like and subscribe our channel Biology Tech and also press the bell icon so you can get all these type of videos on time.